my name is Anita Castaldo and I'm the owner of So To Speak. We, are, we started as a fabric store 11 years ago and then we added yarn three years ago when we moved up here to this big space. That's awesome. I didn't know you guys started with just fabric. That's really cool. Yeah. So what do you have here in oh, the front? This was a display for our yarn crawl that was last week. I have this really cute looking mango uh, cotton. This is cotton. Oh, big, wow. This is their big cotton. Okay. So we have a lot of sweater quantities at this point anyway. And then we have this cute little sample of the cardigan. That's awesome. Oversized cardigan, yeah. I've never seen cotton in such a big yarn. Isn't it cute? Yeah. I know, I love it. And it, people that don't like wool, they love this. Okay. Yeah. That's it's great. It's like, it's got this real cute little texture. Mm-hmm. Got great um, colors too. We have a this is a free pattern. We try to give out a lot of free patterns, especially for shawls. Yeah. And that's out of tie, three skeins of tie, Queensland. Oh, that's a new one for me. Yeah. Yeah. We are a Brooklyn Tweed store. Okay. So we care try to keep a lot of Brooklyn Tweed in stock. And I just have a little. I don't have a sample of this, but this is so cute. This uh, wool and honey. Oh yeah. And I have the yarn, I have sweater quantity of the yarn. I try to get sweater con quantities, especially the popular ones. Yeah, yeah. And then this is crazy uh, yarn from uh, Stonehenge in Michigan. Okay. So this is four skeins of this uh, two colored plied, really cute. And that's a free pattern too. Okay, that's awesome. And then we just mix in with our sewn stuff because yeah. we, we love both. That's great. And then we have, what do we have here? Some more sewing stuff right here in the front? Oh, yeah. Uh, so, Sashiko is huge now, and a lot of my sewers and knitters like to do little projects. Okay. Simple. This is just a running stitch. It's so easy. Oh, wow. And this one, we, we copied the pattern on here and then stitched it. But then I have these little kids that it's printed on. Okay, that's great. Super easy. We sell the thread, the needles, a lot of inspiring books. This is really trendy now. Yeah, I've seen that everywhere online. Oh my gosh, yeah. isn't it great? Mm -hmm. I did a pair of jeans and I wore them in San Francisco where my son lives and he says, Mom, those jeans are awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. I felt like that was a big win. Oh, it me. is, definitely. It's just like so many inspirations. Flannel is big for us coming up in the fall. Yeah. And then here's some we more. We carry a little bit of synthetic yarn. This is one of my um, best selling. It's very inexpensive. It's super soft. The King's Lit blanket. Beautiful. Isn't it cute? Yeah, it's, it's so like cute. Quilty looking. Yeah, I love and the colors. Very simple, just knit, knit, knit. That's a class. Okay. I have had knit, uh, beginners use this. Um, not a great yarn for beginners because it's too slippery. Oh, okay. That wool makes sense. is much better for beginners. So yeah. If you're a beginner, just do wool. Even if you don't think you'll ever wear it, just yeah. use wool because it's easier to knit with. And then a couple of my favorite samples. This is Brooklyn Tweed. Okay. This is a pattern on Ravelry. I remember the name of it is Stone Point. Okay. By Courtney Kelly. It's this beautiful. Is poncho, isn't it? Yeah. Great. The yeah. texture shows up great on isn't that. It? Yeah. No. So it makes you want warm or cold weather. Yeah. Coming. Oh, definitely. And this is a summer, a summer project. This is Barocco. We hear a little bit of Barocco. Okay. Stiva. It's cotton. Okay. Very fun, easy knit. Is it kind of like tape yarn? Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, thanks. That's great. Yeah. Do you knit up your own samples or hire oh, people? No. Well, <laughs> I have a great. I mean, I have done a few. I'll show you one I, I did. Um, I have a great knitter uh, pattern, a sample knitter, Pam, and she did this. She does, she'll just, anytime I want her to, she'll do one. Yeah. And she does it for yarn. Oh, okay. So That's we nice. give her store credit. This is from Baroque. Oh, okay. So if you buy a certain quantity. Oh, really? Yeah. That's really nice. Yeah. That's great. And then you've got a great yarn selection here. Yeah. Oh, this is, this is not on sale anymore. We did <laughs> a lot of sales, so definitely get on, um, get on our email list yeah we do good sales okay so I just I got this one it's not sewing great it's some cotton it's a nice quality cotton but um, 
not our best seller. Yeah. <laughs> More of a wool store, maybe? People like wool? I think people like cotton, oh. but uh, it's got to be the right one. Okay. And I would Im I imagine washcloths, but I think it's too thin for a washcloth. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Some people want something thick. For, Faster. Yeah. Yeah. So we get a lot of beginners because we have sewers that go into knitting. Okay. And this section will be overflowing in a, a month or so when it's cooler. Okay. And we like wool in the gang, loopy mango, and then this Barocco macro. Those are three of our best chunky yarns yeah. that we just sell like crazy in the colder months. Yeah. Also, Carrie, we love Malintosh. Oh, me too. So this is their ASAP, makes a great hat. We've got our, some hat samples up there. So we carry six weights of Brooklyn Tweed, starting with the Chunky Quarry, Shelter, Arbor is probably our best selling. This is uh, um, DK. And then down to Peary and Loft and Veil. This wow. Is lace weight. Am I missing one? I think I got them all. We'll go over the other side and yeah. see if there's one I'm missing. That sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, great. Yeah, so we're not a destination store, but we carry a lot of it. And I will always order in for people if they have a color they want. Yeah. And we don't have enough, mm -hmm. I'll order them a new batch. Yeah. So they have all the same lot, lot, dye lots. Yeah, you've got a great selection of colors. I love how you've organized them Thanks. with these greens. Blue sky, okay. love it. Very affordable. Yeah. Great colors. Really great quality wool. Uh, people love. love yeah. That. It's so soft. Yeah. This is a sample done in our uh, shepherd's wool. Okay. Which these people are awesome. They're up in Michigan, and their yarn is just so wonderful and easy to work with, and, and pretty affordable too, right? Yeah. It yeah. Is. Yeah. Very affordable. That's great. And then there's some more behind here. Yes. Our other yarn wall. So I think I got all the Brooklyn tweed because I thought there was one extra one that I was missing. But nope, it's there. Okay. So we're, we will, in about a week, get a reorder on our Madeline Tosh. Okay. Some, company, some stores don't like to work with Madeline Tosh because you put in your order and you get it and then you can't reorder because oh, okay. that's it. They do a batch for you, they, they die. Yeah. And then, um, so that like somebody wanted three more of these, I couldn't get them. Okay, like for a certain I, period of time. In my next time. batch I can. Okay. And it's usually a little bit of wait time, although they're getting more selective and they're, um, they limited their stores by making you buy a certain amount okay so they they have a minimum purchase for the year okay and if you don't make that then you can't buy from them anymore. okay but we love their yarn yeah. i think it's very affordable for what it is yeah yeah for a hand dye mm -hmm. it's really, really great wonderful. quality everybody loves it they yeah. know it it's consistently it, good yes. yeah and the one that's like that is Mal another one like that is malabrigo yeah so yeah. they um we, we carry some Malabrigo. Mostly they're raw, um, Rios. Okay, yeah. yeah. Yeah, And then, let's see, what else? Just have a little bit of, I usually, uh, it's up front, but I carry a little bit of Sweet Georgia. Okay, yeah. Nice quality yarn. Yeah, that's a great yarn. Um, we're boosting up our fingering weight. That's one um, very popular, easy to sell. Okay. People just will buy those just to work into a shop. So we yeah. Can, that's We're great. We'll be boosting up our fingering this fall. Yeah, and then you've got a bunch of needles. Yep, we carry Knitter's Pride, and then we carry uh, some Chugu, um, the metal ones from Chugu. Yeah, the red lace. Uh huh. Yeah. And then I have sets that are likey. Okay, yeah, I saw those up front. Yeah, they're really yeah. pretty. I think people like them. Um, they say that the the cord is a little bit stiff. Okay. But this, it, it softens up. You can always dip it in hot water. Yeah. And cool it and um, soften it up. But they're interchangeable with the Knitter's Pride cords. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. That's cool. Yeah. yeah. And it seems like crocheting is going bonkers right now. Yeah. Do you know about Tony? Tony? Oh, I do, yeah. Yeah. Tony's Did you great. interview her? No, uh, no but she she's, and I are friends. Yeah, she's great. Yeah, okay. She's yeah, so she's famous fantastic. Now. I know. <laughs> Big superstar. Yes, yeah. yes. Does she teach classes here ever? She will. I and like. She's got like a really 
long lead time. So we'll yeah. get her back yeah. on the schedule. That's yeah. great. Yeah, she, I know. She's just like, she's killing on Instagram. <laughs> I know. She's great. This is one of my favorite samples of... So this is a kit by okay. uh, Wool and the Gang. It's a super fun company. They're yeah. very laid back and fun and inspiring. Yeah. So it's just a really simple knit, and a lot of people don't like it because they have to. You have to sew it together. Yeah. But I'm a sewer, so for me, like right. that's one of the funnest parts. Yeah, I never thought of it together. that way. That's great. So, yeah, I love this little sweater. It's a beautiful color too. Yeah. Thanks. And then you have a beautiful sewing space here. Yeah, that's our that's our sewing um, uh, classroom space. Yeah. How often do you have classes here? I like to have them every day. We oh, are wow. we have been lacking a teacher, so okay. I need quilting teachers and sewing teachers <laughs> and knitting teachers. Yeah. But um, we do pretty good. We have available classroom space every day. Okay. And then our knitting. The knitting classes and crochet classes are usually over here. Oh, really? On like the couches? Yeah. Nice comfy space for. Oh yeah. Yeah. It's and, such a cute area. And people can come in any time and knit here. Yeah. We've got tea. They can get a coffee across the street. Yeah. Or in the basement, there's coffee sometimes. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's awesome. The, our uh, neighbor business that you can get coffee there. Okay. Do you ever have knit nights or anything yes, like that? Yes, we do once a month. On, a fr on Friday, at, um, it's like five to eight. Six to eight. Six to eight. Yeah. Is it every like certain Friday or just changes? Last Friday of the month. Last or third, depending on the holiday. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. And then you just have a great selection of fabric as well. I love how you've lined it all the Thanks. way around the store. Thanks. Yeah, we do uh, a lot of quilting fabric because it's easy to get and oh, there's so much good quilting fabric. Yeah. And people are doing all kinds of stuff with that beyond quilting. They do yeah. bags, they do clothing, kids' clothing, uh, just all kinds of projects, home decor. Yeah. And then in fall, we sell a lot of flannel. Okay. Summertime, and, and really the rest of the year, we sell linen. It's one of our best okay. sellers. Yeah. We have uh, some linen blends that are awesome. Okay, I love we linen. We have knits and rayon and a bunch of other... Um, substrates wax canvas has been really okay popular. Yeah, yeah to make bags yeah. yeah yeah do you organize them in a certain way like by um, a little bit but it's sort of boutique style like yeah you just try to make everything look oh you know yeah pretty look pretty yeah and then things are clumped together but they're everywhere right. wherever we can find yeah spots. yeah we don't have wall space yeah so you have to be creative because it's nice saying things on a wall, but we have very little wall space. Yeah, yeah. I think what you've done is great. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks. It seems like we can maximize the fabric we get in. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. So for people that would be coming in, maybe don't know the area, do you have any like food recommendations nearby oh, yeah. that they can Worthing walk to? Worthington is great for food. Just across the street uh, um, in the downtown Worthington, you have Sassafras Bakery. They're now open seven days a week. Oh, nice. All of them. And they have more than just, ba they have um, real food. Okay. Like um, sandwiches, cool. um, quiche, salads. Uh, Old Bag of Nails is down there. Across the street is the Whitney House. Okay. Really great lunch. Dinner is a little pricey, but it's super yummy. Yeah. They, they're like gourmet. And we have um, a little coffee shop, Highland. Um, La Chatelaine, mm -hmm. and what am I missing? Oh, Graders. Yeah. And there's also a Vietnamese restaurant down there, and they're all within just like a short walk, two minute okay. walk across the street, and you're there. Awesome. And up the street, there's a lot more, and then down in the Clintonville, you have North Star. Oh yeah. And you have now you have Catalina's, and a bunch of other stuff. There's Fusion down there. Mm -hmm. Tons of restaurants. Hot chicken. Hot chicken takeover. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's great. Well, is there anything else that you'd like to share with people about your shop? Oh, we love our customers. I love beginners. I never want anybody to feel bad about like not knowing how to do stuff. So mm -hmm. uh, myself and my staff are very kind to all um, all levels of mm -hmm. sewing, knitting, crocheting. I don't myself know how to crochet. But um, I just I just love all of it. And I, 
it's the fun part of life. Like mm-hmm. a lot of our customers come in, they're all stressed out. They work, they're a nurse, they're a doctor, they're yeah. you know, IT and super stressed. And they come in here and this is their happy place. So we just want them to yeah. come in and be happy and enjoy making whatever they make. That's wonderful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for showing me around your store. Welcome,